Yes, so today we're going to be talking about Wuthering Waves Convene. So what is Convene? Convene in Wuthering Waves is the summoning in this game. So let's get right into it. Here are some of the banners. So this is the beginner's choice banner. In the beginner's choice banner you pick one of the five units. You can either pick Zhan Xin, Kalkaro, Verena, Ling Yang and Anko. Currently, the most wanted unit is Yangshin. Yangshin is an amazing unit. This is definitely a recommended unit to pull. If you want someone that does a lot of damage, a lot of bursts, and overall, come on guys, it's Sephiroth's voice actor in JP. Gotta pull for this guy, Kalkero. Kalkero just does insane, insane damage. But he's definitely worth picking. Verena, well, she's essentially like the Barbara from Genshin, but yeah, she's also pretty cool as well. Amazing healing, amazing buffs overall. She's just going to be keeping your team alive and she's going to be very good for harder content. So if you've got Kalkaro, you've got Yangshin, I definitely recommend pulling for Verena. If you've got all three of these, Yangshin, Kalkaro and Verena, I would definitely recommend pulling for Encore because Encore is just so, so good. Good damage, good range. And when you combine her with all these guys, it's just insane unit overall. So... Essentially, top priority pick, Zhang Xin, one of the best ones. Kalkero, best DPS overall, just very good for hard content. Verena, well, she's just going to keep your team alive and overall, she's just one of those units that a lot of people want because obviously healers are going to be big for the harder content or if you want to progress through the story. So she's definitely worth picking up. Encore, if you like Encore and you like her design and things, and overall, she's a decent unit, definitely recommend picking her up too. Ling Yang, I'm not too sure yet. I've had to experiment more with this unit, but I hear that this unit is not sought after a lot. It's an okay unit. Maybe in the future they'll buff it or make it better, but overall, this unit right now is like the last pick, essentially, at the moment. But yeah, for picking characters, definitely pick between these. I definitely recommend Zhang Xin as your main pick. You always want to get her first, and then Kalkaro, definitely. And how this banner will work is once you've done the beginner's choice, you need to do essentially 80 summons in total. Well, more so 8 pulls, because essentially you're doing 10 per pull. So once you've done that, you're guaranteed to get a 5 star. And the 5 star that you pick, and let's say you don't want Verena, so you just go and click on, I don't know, maybe Ling Yang. Boom. Now Ling Yang will be the main unit, and as you see, my remaining convene hasn't changed whatsoever. So don't worry about changing between units. If you don't know another unit, definitely change, but yeah. Now let's talk about the first premium banner. The first premium banner prevailed the last la yeah. prevailed the lasting night with Jian. Is a very good banner. He's an insane unit to get, does good damage overall, just generally a very good unit. This is where you're going to need the premium currency. Let's take a look at the premium currency. Okay, as we can see here, Radiant Tide. Radiant Tide is the premium currency they use for the premium banners. Lustrous Tide is what you use for the normal banners. Essentially, this is just going to be your standard currency that you use for those other banners. Forging Tide, this is going to be for your weapons. As you can see, the currencies are split into three. This is being your premium side where when you get those four stars and things, you'll get this coral, which basically you can use to exchange for these premium currencies. This is essentially what you want to do once you get those summons in. So this is where you'll exchange for your premium currencies, your weapon currencies and your normal currency. Oscillated core. Oscillated core is like essentially every time you do a summon, this builds up and then it resets over time. So for now, as you can see, I don't have any other currencies here, but normally the lustrous tides and the other tide is essentially normally here. But at the moment, they're not here due to me buying them all currently. You've also got these upgrades here if you need to upgrade anything, so you can buy some upgrades from here. Tidal exchange, well, this is essentially the currency you get from playing the game. This is basically like your primo gems. So if you're trying to buy summoning currencies here or weapon currencies here and you can essentially use your primo gems or asteroids as they call them in this game to get those currencies here as you can see here you just click on it it'll tell you how many you can get and then boom exchange confirm and there we go we got two radiant tides 
So, that's for the currencies and the banners. Let's have a look at the weapon banner. Okay, so this is the first weapon banner. This weapon banner is essentially Jian's weapon. But this weapon is a very good weapon. Strong weapon, does a lot of damage. Just overall, just an amazing weapon. So, trying to pull for those weapon banners. This is a really good weapon banner to start off with. This is also another choice weapon banner. Once you do it, the 80 convene bolts, you can get yourself this beautiful weapon. But there's multiple weapons here. You can pick between all these weapons here. So if there's any weapon here you want that you need for a specific character, you can change it anytime. And same as the other banner, the choice banner, you pick your weapon. Once you've done your 80 summons, you get the guaranteed weapon of choice. So overall, this is a really good banner. I definitely recommend looking into this and essentially summoning for this banner if you need any of these beautiful weapons. So yeah, that's most of the currencies and things. If you guys want to add me, here's my user ID. There's my YouTube. There's my Twitch. And yeah, have, thank you for watching my video. Drop a like, subscribe, and comment below who your current favorite character is. Peace.